Is there a point to doing this? Uh oh. <laughs> I am a dumbass. All right, so we're back, final hour, and uh, yeah, let's see what uh, what's left. Because we still haven't gone through uh, quite everything yet. Uh, boom. Uh, we do have our needle, though. Which way? North by northeast. Okay. Oh, there's something over here. Is that, is that blue? I think that's a blue one. So I don't think we need that. Well, that's all right. Okay, we've got mannequin people down here. Hello, mannequin people. Swamp of Aeonia, we're back. Oh, another Sight of Grace, okay. Sure, sure. Whoop. Here we are. What's this one called? Celia Understair. Cool. Oh yeah, I guess we are just kind of like right there. Oh, did that reset the... Oh. Oh, there's all kinds of things happening. Uh, well, let's stay on the ground level here. Ooh, rotten straight. Oh, we can su summon puppies. Let's see, did we go up... Oh, watch out. Did we go up here before? Oh, I don't think we did. Look at here. Oh, have we found a mine? Oh, the Cilia Crystal Tunnel. Okay. I guess we found a mine. Um... There we go. That... What do we have here? Some rot grease. Lovely. Uh, okay, I guess we're going up the ladder. Anything up here? Got one of these. The summoning pool is now functional. Boy, that looks like it should be a secret area, but I don't believe it is. Oh, we've got some of these high-pitched laser drills that are somehow simultaneously satisfying and piercing. Cracked crystal. Oh, God. Oh, what the hell? Oh, we've got some shrimp people. All the sounds they make are not sounds that I want between my ears. Oh. Oh, we got another digger's staff. Picking up all kinds of things. Oh. Just smithing stones on the side here. Ugh, come on. There you go. Smithing stone five. Glintstone scrap. Ah! <laughs> where, where are they? It's like I'm getting hit by their goo, but I can't actually see them. I've got like laser precision. I should get some some bestial vitality going while I'm running around getting smacked to death. Uh, I keep passing it. There we go. I have too many spells. <laughs> okay. Acquire materials. Oh. It's like they're definitely above. Okay, there it is. All right, all right. Ow. Can I, can I get in here? Oh, chest of treasures. Gravity stone fan. And a gravity stone chunk. All right. Be wary of up. <laughs> yeah, for real. Can I get you to like drop down maybe? 
There you are. Ha! Huh. Well, that was embarrassing. There we go. You? I can't hit the dang thing. Uh oh. All right, you know what? I'm tired of fooling with you. There we go. Goodness gracious. Uh, well, there, it looks like the way there is a way forward by going that way, but it also looks like we can't get back out if uh, if we head that direction. So let us go this way. Oh, hello. Are you cool? Boy, you are weird looking. There. There we go. Might as well collect all this cracked crystal. I, I, it's got to be used for crafting in some way. I just don't quite know how. Okay. Ooh. Oh, that's very pretty. It's a shame I'm going to destroy you. <laughs> Uh-oh. All kinds of goodies there. Oh, oh, another one of you. It's like, what even is that? Is it... Like, it almost looks like webbing, but I don't think it is. Because I don't think there are spiders. Oh, they're so repulsive. Got another glaive. Ooh, got a rune arc. Probably death if we fall off of there. Let's get another bestial vitality going. There we are. Let's see. This, this way, perhaps? Maybe dropping down over there is the, the way to go, because I don't see any other immediately obvious way to, to get above. So, all right. Let us, let us drop. Can I do that, and then can I get over there? Well, <laughs> I try. Maybe, maybe we drop down onto it from above, especially if this- oh, shit! Well, I asked for that. There we go. <laughs> okay. Ooh, the other thing that'll help- I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna throw on my- my dew talisman, just so we can keep getting HP back from both the talisman and uh, our bestial vitality. Because all that, I mean, yes, it's useful what the talisman did. Um, you know, it reduces our, the cost of our flame sword and sword laser, which is, uh, you know, certainly welcome, but, um, oh god. Oh, I'm using my knife. Why, why am I using my knife? <laughs> Ow. Oh, they're so... They're so... Mobile. There we go. Good lord. Alright. Anything in here? Ooh, a chest of treasures. What have we here? The Rock Blaster Sorcery. Okay. Sounds fun. Uh, first off, down. Okay, well, I guess we jump down. Boop. Cuckoo Glintstone. I've never even used one of those. <laughs> is that, uh... Is that worth it? I mean, I've got so much stuff in my inventory. Like, I really probably should. <laughs> Just like, spend a little time looking at everything and, uh... You know, being like, is this a, is, should I be using this stuff? Because I feel like some of, I mean, I think those cuckoo glintstone things, or whatever, 
I mean, I, I think they're pretty much like hand grenades, if I'm not mistaken. And it's like, why haven't I been using that? I mean, that sounds super useful, you know? Everybody could use a hand grenade. Golden rune. Oh, can I kick this down? I can. There we go. Oh, shit. Go. Got two. Anything else up here? Be wary of dastard. <laughs> okay. Well, I don't think I can go that way. Or at least it's backtracking. Alrighty, what do we have here? A level four smithing. There's got to be somewhere that has level sixes. Because that's what I need, I think. Uh, hello? Uh, question mark? Be wary of lift. I can hear something. Oh, God. I can hear skitters and other... Oh, yep, yeah, there you are. Sure enough. Ha! Huh. Well, I jumped right over top of it. Here, if I just hide behind this little wall, can you... There we go. Alright, those up there don't seem to have cared. I'll probably just use a... I'll probably just use a... a sword flame on them. Just so I don't have to deal with them. More dragon wound grease. Alright, you all... All right, let me get a good angle. All right, here you go. Awesome. Alrighty. Getting lots of level five smithing stones, though. I don't know where we are. Faithful Canvas Talisman. Faithful's Canvas Talisman. And it is a talisman. <laughs> All righty, uh, let's see. Where is that Star Scourge heirloom? Here we are. Talisman bearing an icon that depicts a group of masked figures raises potency of incantations. The figures represent the flock at prayer, their firm belief in the intangible, inspiring even the solitary founder of their religion. What is faith if not an affirmation? Okay, so this will uh, this will boost up our uh, our holy juice. Um, let there be precious item. Alas, there is no precious item. <laughs> um, anything else up here? I don't think so. Anything under here? I don't think so. Okay. Oh, okay, we're at the boss room then. Oh lordy, um, I have no idea what... Visions of death, but let there be hope. Sometimes there's a smithing stone off to the side, but... Does not seem to be the case here. Okay. Alrighty, uh, well, can we maybe see what's in there? Something large. Yeah, I can't tell what it is. Whatever it is, it's large. So, uh, let's see. Let's go ahead, let's put our. God, what, what, what even was it? This one. Let's put our filigreed thingamabob back on. All right, we're going to call on the power of Grayskull. So let's do this. By the power of Grayskull. Get our wolves ready. Slap on some bestial vitality. Oh, I'm going to have to do a sippy because I'm out of juice from my wolves. Okay. Well, let's see what the heck this thing is. The Falling Star Beast. What is... Oh! Oh, that's... Oh, no, I hit the wrong button. I didn't mean to cast a spell. Ow. Oh, it's very weird. Here, do you like fire? Oh, you do not like fire. Okay. Whoa. 
It's like a bull, but with the head of a centipede. Because, oh god. I can't see. Whoa. Oh, it's, it's very athletic. <laughs> Here, have, have some fire. Have more fire. Have even more fi Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, take a sippy. Boy, look at this thing go. Duh. Oh, what's it doing? What's it doing? Oh, it's got- Whoa. Here, I have magic too. There we go. Wow. What a weird looking thing. Hey, there's our level six stone. Heck yeah, we can upgrade our, our Sword of Night and Flame. Ooh, a level 7 smithing stone, a gravity stone chunk, a gravity stone chunk, and the somber stone miner's bell bearing. Ooh. We may have to go back to uh, Round Table Hold and uh, see what in the world we, uh, we can do now. Because we, uh, yeah, goodness gracious, I think we can now upgrade our sword again. Which, definitely imperative. Let's go ahead and rest here. Uh. Whoa. Mar no, I don't want a marker. What did I just do? There we go. That's what I wanted to do. Table of Lost Grace. Yeah, we'll upgrade our sword. Uh, maybe we'll run around and talk to everybody real quick just to be sure that we're not missing anything. Okay, nothing new from you. Oh, I'm running over books again. Are you still in here? Journey to the capital, let okay. you think you may be our best. Alright, nothing new here. Cool, cool. Alrighty, we'll go in here. We can drop off that bell bearing. Okay. This sh okay, we can now buy somber stones one and two. Cool, cool. I think we can also buy them from EG, can't we? I don't know how many he, he has, but... Uh, is this thing still... Yeah, he's still just chilling in there. Um, okay, you didn't have anything new. There's nothing up there. Nothing in here. Let's talk to you. I think this is just asking... Yeah, you're just telling me about the, the weird... Uh, nasty dude in the other room. I guess we could talk to her again. I pleased to see you again. Would you like me? Now. I guess let, we'll just let her hold us and see what... Because uh, I don't know if, if in order to talk to her we have to keep letting her hold us, or if she'll just naturally engage us in conversation. You are so... So very warm. Okay, we get the Baldekin blessing. Oh, we can actually talk to her. Uh, may I ask a favor? My dear, might I ask something of you? Could you please find the owner of this dagger and return it to them? Hmm. Okay, the weathered dagger. A certain person gave it to me as a gift. It's a very precious thing. It must have a special place in the owner's heart. So I would like for the original owner to have it back, if you wouldn't mind. Okay, uh, about the dagger. I'd like you to find the owner of the dagger I gave you and return it to them. It's a very precious thing. It must have a special place in the owner's heart. Must it? Okay. Then good day to you, my dear. Okay, I guess we'll see what this dagger is all about. Can we get a look at you? I don't know that I've telescoped you yet. Like, some of these people, like, have, you know, like, distinguishing marks and just other oddness about them. Uh, okay, well, let's see. I assume the dagger was probably a key item. Um, uh, there it is. Dagger received from Fia, the deathbed companion. She wishes for it to be returned to its rightful owner. 
It was once a special weapon of gold and silver intertwined, but is now worn down and marred by a black gash. I mean, the only thing I know of with gold and silver intertwined is, uh, is D. See, he's got like the gold and silver thing. Hello? Did you need something else? Oh, the weather. Okay, weathered dagger. Well, what have we here? How did you get your hands on that dagger? Well, that hardly matters. I know very well whose dagger it is. Why don't I return it to them for you? Good work bringing this to me. Uh, okay. Well, <laughs> I guess that's that then. Uh, do we go talk to her again? I am pleased to see you again. Would you like me to hold you? The blessing is still. Would you like? Yes, yes. Please yeah. hold me so we may whisper Come in secret. Closer. Yep. Good day to you. Oh, I guess that's it. Well, shoot. Okay. Maybe I have to reset the area. So maybe I have to rest at, at the table of lost grace. Oh boy. Okay. Well, let's. Uh... Well, I took you for no matter. Lay out your own. Okay. Yeah. Let's let us upgrade our sword of night and flame. Heck yeah. Boom. All right, now we just need a level seven in order to, to upgrade it. Huh, can slash should we upgrade our other things? I mean, we probably should upgrade our claw mark seal because we've been using the bestial incantations. So yeah, we've got plenty of uh, early level smithing stones to do just that. So uh, yeah. I mean, honestly, yeah, it's almost on par with our regular seal. Um, it's only like one less point of uh, of efficacy there, of, of scaling power. I guess let's shoot, let's just boost it up. Boom. Might as well boost them both, right? I didn't know he he lol. Um, longbow. Let's see. Boost. And well, if I, hmm, I gotta make a, I gotta make a choice here. <laughs> well, let's just boost the claw mark seal, because with the, uh, with the, uh, yeah, what am I trying to say here? Because of the scaling, um, and because of our stats, this one I think is more worth it to, to pump up, especially since it um, beefs up our our vitality thing. So yeah, we'll just we'll do it first. You know what? Why not? Um. Oh wow. Uh. Yeah. It's okay. So it's at level four. 13 now. Oh, maybe we should uh, bump up our Lord Sworn Straight Sword now that we actually can. Just so we uh, have it beefed up a bit. Okay. Oh yeah, we also have all this other cool stuff we've picked up along the way. Uh, carry a Knight Sword. Yeah, we have all kinds of neat things we, we've grabbed. Like this... Uh, where was it? Yeah, the uh, Meteoric Ore Blade sounded really cool. Um, and so did Moonvale. Everything sounded cool! Looks like Moonvale maybe has better scaling. I'm gonna hold off for now. Um, okay, let's go talk to Nefeli Lu, see if she's come out of her state. No. Nope, she is not. Father has all now. 
I don't think there's anything back over here. Nope. Okay, we'll rest at the table of lost grace. Uh, first and foremost, though, uh, let us get rid of this seal, because now our claw mark seal is more powerful than our regular standard seal, at least as far as I can tell. Um, so let's rest here. Oh, D is gone now. Okay. So maybe that advanced the quest. Let's run back. Um, oh, she's gone as well. Um, okay. <laughs> well, we definitely advanced the quest line. Greetings. Are you here for Does anybody know anything? Oh, this, this door is open now. Well. I took you for no matter it's lay out your arms. Yeah, this door's open now. Uh, hello? Oh! Oh, what's happening here? Oh, it's a nice little fireplace. H hang on, I know there's a dead body over there, but... But I gotta, I gotta look at this fireplace. Oh, I love the little book and candle up there. Kinda dangerous putting a candle on top of a book, but, you know. Anything, anything up above the fire? Whoops. Anything above? Oh, I think it actually just ends there, so it's just not a very safe fireplace. Okay, what's going on? Oh. Oh. I mean, this is clearly D, but D has... D has vines and such growing out of him. Uh... Hello? Oh god. D's bell bearing. The twinned helm. The twinned armor. The twinned gauntlets. The twinned greaves. Um, hello? Finally, it is returned to its rightful place. The stolen Hallowbrand of the exalted noble. And now, I must bid you goodbye as well. Though I ask you deliver this message to the round table hold. I am Via. Deathbed companion. Hark round table. Disturb not the death of Godwin, the exalted. We who humbly live in death, live in waiting. To one day welcome our Lord. What right does anyone have to object? Our Lord will rise. The Lord of the many and the meek. Okay. Oh. All right. So she just floated away. <sighs> ah, corpse. Yeah, D is. Uh, wow, he's even got flies around him now too. Well, did I do something wrong here? Did I do a bad thing by doing this whole dagger knife? quest line. Is this... Can I go this way? I cannot. Um, how about... Uh, how about D's stuff? Is it an upgrade? Um, a helm depicting entwined twins of gold and silver. The two known as D are inseparable twins. They are of two bodies and two minds, but one single soul. Not once do they stand together. Not one word do they speak to one another. Perhaps this armor longs to find its way to the other D. What? So there's another D out there? Wait. Is this not... Was this a different... Are they two people in one, or... I don't understand. <laughs> Uh, how about anything here? Oh, this armor is actually an upgrade. We finally found an upgrade. Uh, two known as D are in so, so were they like conjoined twins, like existing together? Yeah, of two bodies and two minds, but one soul. Not once do they stand together, not one word do they speak to one another. 
God, I, 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 I just, I can't understand riddles. <laughs> um. Well, sure. Let's, uh, I guess let's equip it. Well, let's see if the other stuff is an upgrade as well. Uh, twin gauntlets. No, not an upgrade. Are the boots an upgrade? The, the legs are not a full upgrade. The armor is, though, so let's, uh, boop. All right, we're at a heavy roll now. Is there a way we can alleviate that without sacrificing too much else? If I remove the dagger. Okay, the dagger did not matter. If I remove the dagger and the bow, I can, I can maintain. Um, how about... Let's see. What if I go back to wearing... What if I go back to wearing my banished night helm? Can I re-equip my dagger now without it being a problem? I can equip the dagger. I can not equip the bow. Well, I'd rather have the bow than the dagger. So... Well, for heaven's sake. Um, I mean, I could level up and just put some points into endurance, but, you know. <laughs> um, Alright, you know what? I'm just going to go back to wearing what I was wearing. It was working. Everything was fine. I had a weird helmet, but... But it was fine. Okay. Sacred dagger. There's my bow. Well, I thought... I thought the dog helmet was an... Or the imp helmet was an upgrade. I guess it's not. What the heck did I see, then? Am I a fool? The prisoner mask. I don't know what's going on here, but maybe I was using the wrong thing. Uh, all right, whatever. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Goodness gracious. So I'm supposed to spread the message of, of round of Fia or whatever. So I guess. Greetings. Are you here for do I have to tell that to somebody specifically, or...? Back already, no matter. Can we finally snap Nefeli Lu out of her funk? No. Nope. How could I say father? Maybe we tell Gideon? Nothing in here. Well, first and foremost, let's go ahead and use up our, uh... Where is it? Our, our baldkin blessing. There it is. I just, I don't like it because it causes our uh, our health to, to go down. Um, hey, uh, Gideon, do you need to know about Journey anything? To the capital, the two things. You may be our bet. Blah, 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 nope. Alrighty, what about weird dude in the back? He's the only person we haven't really talked to yet. I don't even know if he has new dialogue. I asked you not to be thankful. Nope. It is all that keeps you. Okay, nothing new. I guess that's it then. Uh, let's rest. Boom. And just in case that resetting the area is what advances things, let me check Gideon one last time. Journey to the cap. The two things you may be out. Because that's the thing with like these games. Sometimes you have to reset the area before you can. Well, as we just found, you have to reset the area before it'll advance the quest line. So let's run in here. Sometimes items will appear after you've, you know, had an incident occur. Okay, nothing's here. This door probably is okay. All right, fine, whatever. We upgraded our stuff. Um, 
Heck. I guess let's go back to Inner Aeonia. Celia Understair. We went here to the Crystal Tunnel. Yeah, let's go to Inner Aeonia. And, uh... Just do one last little check of the, the big rotten area in the middle. And we'll, uh... We'll move on. We got about, uh... Right at half an hour left. So, yeah. Let's see. We've... I think we've been here before. This is where the... Yeah, we went up through there. We came over here. Oh, we did miss this, though. Whatever this is. There's one of these little... Little Twinkle Toes people. Oh, I missed it. Dang it. The fact that it's got... Golden uh, Trail makes me think it's... Oh, man, come here. Makes me think it's going to do a miracle or something. Or a miracle. An incantation. So let's see. It comes down through there. There we go. Poison armament. Okay, so we can poison our weapon. All right. Yay, question mark? Okay. All right, we went up through there already. Because that was the way to... Uh, whoa. What was that? Oh! There are people. Okay, let's run back down through here. Alright, we unlocked this side of grace, so... Last thing I can think of to do would be to just kind of check this... Uh, this area over here. Yeah, there's the golden thingamabob. Is this, uh... Yeah, there's the, the dude. So, yeah, we've made a full circuit. Um, so I guess we'll drop off the, uh... I guess we'll drop off that broken needle thing. Oh, maybe we should read the item description before we turn it in. Just to see if there's something amazing about it. Uh, hi, puppy dog. Boy, you're weird looking. Oh, you even have a little messed up spiked collar. What a weird, what a weird thing. Um, okay, I assume it was a key item, so let's see. Uh, here we are. An intricately crafted needle of unalloyed gold snapped in half. A ritual implement crafted to ward away the meddling of outer gods. It is thought capable of forestalling the incurable rotting sickness. Sage Gowry has designs for this needle. Okay. Oh, you found the unalloyed gold needle. Indeed. As promised, I've detailed the secret of Celia right here. Go on. It's yours. Okay, Celia's secret. All right. Now let me have a look at the needle. Mm. 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 <laughs> well, well, this is a marvel indeed. The work of a true artisan, a meticulous, bold craftsman who grasps the essence of life. Can you give me some time with this? As well made as it is, it won't be much use snapped in half, will it? Fair point. <laughs> uh, anything else? Can you give me as well, mate? Okay, all right, I guess that's it then. All right, so I guess let's read Celia's Secret. Is that also a key item, or... Oh, we have... D oh! Oh, shoot, we forgot to give this to, to the, the husks. Oh, man, we're going to have to warp back. <laughs> um... Where... let's see, where would the secrets be? Where are the secrets? Um, here we are, Celia's secret. Note given by Sage Gallery detailing the secret he promised. The town of Celia hides the source. Light three flames atop the candle towers to break the seal. Oh boy, we gotta light more flames. Oh heavens, okay. 
Well, I guess let's try and light some flames. And, uh... What is that? Is that... What am I looking at here? Oh. Weird. Okay. Do I have to, like, shoot it with fire or something? Um... Behold, ill-omened creature. I see no ill-omened creature. Unless you're talking about me. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, we got some butterflies. Oh, God. Oh, hello. Ow. Alright, y'all just straight up warped in. Um, okay. Ouch. Boy, there, there is definitely wizardry afoot here. Ow. Yeah, like, are these spirits? Or are these people? Or, well... Or they are certainly everywhere. Okay, but how do I... How do I light whatever it is I am meant to light? I also hear some, some twinkles. Oh, here's something. Poison blue. Delicious. Is... Isn't there a sight of grace, like, right below me? Yeah, right there. Okay. Since this sight of grace is right here, I'm going to go ahead and warp back to... Uh, Round table hold, just so I can give D's bell bearing to the the husk, because I, I want to see if there was some kind of uh, benefit of doing that. Like maybe something we can buy. Okay, offer bell bearing. D's bell bearing. Bell bearing shop one. D's bell bearing. Oh, oh, okay. Well, wow, that was really loud. Sorry. It's just the spells that he had. Okay. Anything else? Uh, glintstone scraps. No, I don't think there's anything else. Okay, well, good to know. I have no more bell bearings. Alright. Okay, back across the entire world again. Um, stare of the thing. There we go. I just had to know. I just had to know. Because I didn't know. And now I know. Okay, let us mount. Let us... Let us try to find things to light, I guess. Can I... Do it this way? Oh, I kind of can. Oh, there's a... There's a thing on there. Ah. Yeah, okay, so there's a seal. And apparently there's supposed to be... Th three things we can light in this weird place? Somehow, some way? I'm going to assume this is the... Oh! Oh, hell yeah! Is this perhaps another sippy? Hope ahead. Oh, maybe over there. Ugh! Is this perhaps one? There we go. Be careful. Don't fall. Wow, this reminds me of Dark Souls 1, climbing the bell tower to, to ring the bell. Uh, okay. Light flame. Okay. Ooh, a seal was broken somewhere. Oh, fun. Oh, right there. Okay. We Bloop. Okay, so that one was broken. I guess we hop... Can... Can I... Ugh, I don't know that I can survive that. <laughs> there we are. Oh, there's a, a shiny dude over there. Oh, a shiny dude right there. There's so many shinies. Oh, God. Can I get over there? How? Uh... Okay, we got you. Uh, we're just building hopping. 
like Spider-Man, but with a horse. Oh man, you're a teleporty. Well, I do have a bow, so... There we go. Double slash, okay. Ooh, there's a shiny over there. There we are. Whoop. Okay. Let us very, very... What is that? There's... What am I seeing? I have no idea what that thing is. Let us approach it. Stone sword key. Alright. Huh. Alright, I guess we'll light this. A seal in town was broken. I do not know where, but hey. Whoa! Alright, and I assume the other one is up here. There we are. Huh. Alright, let us get down if we can. Oh. Alright, climby climb. A seal was broken in town somewhere. Probably that one. Yep, okay, well, I mean, that was all three, so all seals must be broken now. Um, so, let's see. I know that there was one uh, on ground level, and there was one over there, and then there was one by the, uh, the tree. Toxic mushroom. Anything this way? No. There's a puppy dog. Um. Okay, nothing that way. Oh god, what is that? Rally fruit. Ah! Stop! Stop! Ow! Ooh, a chest of treasures. What do we have here? Ooh, another imbued st Ah, shit! Well, we now have two imbued um, thingamabobs. Whoa. There we go. Okay. Or wait, is, do we have three now? Those are key items. Two. We have two. Okay. I think that might be all we need, right? Whoa! Alright, so... Alright, there's another seal somewhere, I think. Ah. I think it was down through here. It was like right... Was it... Was it... He here it is. A chest of treasures. Alright. Night con... Oh, shit! Get out of here with your business. Alrighty. Hi. Hi. Okay, well, we got Night Comet. Let's go ahead and do a sippy, just in case. Ooh, there's something up here. Ah. Some poison grease. Delicious. Uh... I think we went that whoa. We went that way already. There was something I, I think we unlocked a passageway over here. Yes. Oh, oh, is this a boss room? Weak foe ahead. If only I had a necessary item. Weak foe. Weak foe. <laughs> Seems like a unanimous uh Weak foe ahead. Alright, let's see what uh, what's up here. Because this also... Un oh, a Sight of Grace is up here. Okay. Well, we might as well unlock this. Alrighty. There we go. I guess now that we've done that... Let's just go, let's go see what this weak foe is all about. Oh boy!
And we unlocked the Sight of Grace, so we'll just warp to it once we get finished here. Um... I think that's pretty much all my my beefiness so okay let's go for it i have no idea what this is nox so okay nox swordstress and nox monk oh dear god they are indeed weak foes well all right that's that <laughs> the nox flowing sword Ooh. And we get another one of these. All right. Well, that <laughs> that was a little anticlimactic, but hey, that's why we have our super-powered sword. Right, and we get a chest of treasures. Ooh, Lusat's glintstone staff. Ooh. Let's look at these treasures that we have acquired. Um. The Nox Flowing Sword, a grim weapon wielded by swordsmen of the Eternal City. This shotel has a blade as fine as a needle. Forged from the liquid metal of a silver tear, it is thoroughly tempered until hardened. Oh, that is truly a nasty looking weapon. And what was the other thing? Uh, some kind of sorcery thingamabob. Yeah, here we are. Lusat's Glintstone Staff. Pra uh, praff. Staff of the primeval Glintstone Sorcerer, Lusat. Only those who have glimpsed what lies beyond the wisdom of stone may wield it. Enhances the power of all sorceries, but consumes additional FP. Wow, this, this is... I am way too... Uh, uh, foolish to use this. 52 intelligence. Holy cow. Alright, well. Fun fun. Is this a secret? I think not. <laughs> okay. Um. Alright, I guess that's all that's in here. Let us now. Yeah, let's just warp up, up to here to the Celia back streets. Back streets, back. Okay, do we get our sippies back? Yes. Oh, wait. We, we received a new uh, golden seed. Therefore, we can upgrade our flasks. We now have even more sippies. Uh, allocate flask charges. We have seven and four. Maybe we do six and five. You know? Why not? I really like having the blue sippies so I can keep doing my magic stuff. I guess the the more and more I uh, advance and build the character, the more I very much enjoy the magic. What is that? What What is going on? There's something... Oh! <laughs> I was like, there's something floating on the ground. Like, what has happened? Oh, you're a beefy dude. Ow. Ow. Jeez. Ow. You are strong. Okay, so... Alright, let's bestial vitality this. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, I don't know if... Since I've upgraded the uh, the thing, my, my seal, whoa. Is there a point to doing this? Uh-oh. I am a dumbass. Uh, last side of grace, please. <laughs> you know. <laughs> you know. <laughs> oh boy. Just was not even thinking, you know? I was just like, oh, I can do this. This is fine. Alrighty, let's just collect that. Okay. I mean, there's clearly... I mean, it looks like you're meant to go exploring, you know? Wow. 
Is this just an undead zone here? I guess so. Uh, let's just run. I mean, we're on our horse. It's not like they're gonna catch up. Oh dear. Oh shit! Will that... Will that... Will that happen again? <laughs> Good lord. Yeah, what are we... Uh-oh. Uh ah! I don't care for that. Yeah, we're on like a graveyard gauntlet kind of situation here. Boy, what are we... What are we ascending to? Like, where are we? Oh. Whoa. Oh, boy. Oh, that is... That is a lot of, uh... That, that's a lot of undead people. Alright, well, you know what we're gonna do? We're in the undead zone, so we're gonna use... Gonna use our nonsense. There we go. Ow. There we go. There we go. I've got the holy juice on my sword, so y'all... Y'all are going down. Ow. <laughs> there we go. Any more of y'all? Okay. <laughs> Oh, dear God, don't launch yourself off the side. Okay, I guess back to the Sword of Night and Flame. Nothing up there, it looks like. Oh, we've got some... we got these dudes. Oh, hey, we've got the Church of the Plague. Beautiful, beautiful. Exactly where I want to be. Oh boy, okay. Is there anything in here that's going to murder me? Oh. Sac some sacramental bud. Before I unlock that, is there anything in the surrounding area? Erdly flower. Have I been down there? I don't know. Huh. I think, yeah, I think I'm in some kind of weird area that I haven't seen before. All kinds of this, uh, sacramental bud in the area. I don't know, does that stuff respawn? Whoa. Oh, hello. Blood stain, but jumping off? <laughs> Um, I just want to explore the area a little bit before I, uh, oh, here we are. Another starlight shard. Oh, a lovely little pool of disease and rot. Okay, let's go back. Presumably this will be a sacred tier. Oh, there's a person here. Hello? First off, hit. Um. Who's there? Oh, this uh, is Millicent, maybe. It matters not. If you are wise, you will leave immediately. My flesh writhes with scarlet rot. It is a curse. Not to be meddled with by man. Um, well, I just did a quest for a dude who might be able to fix you. If you are wise, you will leave immediately. My flesh writhes with scarlet rot. Can we get a look at you? Well, you certainly, uh, have seen better days, I think. Oh, did you, like... Oh, I think you amputated your arm. Oh, man, did you, uh... Okay. I mean, I guess if you've got the the plague, then you gotta do what you gotta do. Um, there's all kinds of sacramental bud here. 
Uh, head ahead. Could this be a sword fighter? Well, we got our sacred tier. I guess we could rest here. And we can upgrade our sippies. Indeed, indeed. Um, hmm. Can we talk again? If you are wise, you may flesh. Huh. I don't know that there's anything else we can do, is there? Let's see, yeah, it's just Millicent. Um, I guess we, we move on? Because the dude said he needed time in order to do whatever it is he's wanting to do. So, question mark? All right, well. Oh, goodness, look at the time, okay. Uh, gatekeeper for those returning to the roots. Oh, yeah, absolutely. I'm definitely going to be able to get down there. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, well, uh, we are at the time limit. Um, heck, uh, I'll just go back over to the uh, to the church. And, uh, yeah, I guess that'll be where where we call it. I, uh, I had no idea. Um, I wasn't paying attention to the time. So, okay, yeah, Church of the Plague... And uh, we, we shall rest. And goodness gracious, that'll do it. Um, wow, 